everyone, it's Nona Grace. And yes, I'm uploading a video. You know, I was thinking, how can I do this? Because I really don't want to miss a day. Because I've done so well since um, December. I think it was the 1st of December is when I started this everyday video. And I really don't want to miss. And I was thinking, how in the world can I make a video and still get it up today? like I typically would be putting it up. Usually I make it just before I post it. Well, this one is going to be made. It's I'm making it on today. It's still today, but I'm making it bef a little after noon. I'm all by myself. The dog saw me get the camera and barked and wanted in the house so he could be put into his little carrier so that he can he can rest while I make the video. And I was getting a cup of coffee and I thought, you know, maybe I'll just make a video. I can schedule this. So that's what I'm doing. I'm going to schedule it to appear at my usual time. Um, what I was doing earlier today is I, my daughter, the one that doesn't call me. <laughs> oh, they when they need you, they need you. Well, she finally came after many calls and many my badgering her and whatever and I called her the one day and I said you know you have that wedding you're in when do you plan on having the dress altered and she goes well I guess I could come tomorrow <laughs> what if I don't want to do it tomorrow well tomorrow came and I started the dress and I had her try it on so I could measure to see how far I had to um cut it I wish she would have bought the waltz style dress because she would have it would have fit her like a ball gown instead of buying the regular because I had to cut off seven inches that's a lot of inches to cut off and she didn't get me an easy dress to do I'm usually pretty good at just hemming I can hem I can do some sewing but I'm not a seamstress and I'm not an I'm not a tailor so she got the dress that not only does it have one layer, it's got two layers, and then it's got chiffon on top of that with a draping area that really is boggling. I've cut the chiffon, I just cut the chiffon while I was listening to Nut and Tina. I was listening to their video because they're, they're a fun group of sisters. That they, it's, it's, inter, it's entertaining. I don't have to watch them. I could work on my, on my project. And I got the chiffon cut, and now I've got the front part that drapes. I've got it pinned to the other part, and I'm debating how I want to do this. I haven't sewed that part yet. I did sew the two under skirts that were there, the top skirt and the underskirt. I've already sewed them, and they looked really good. And now I have the chiffon to do, and I have to finish it. And then I decided, well, you know, for my, the wedding I'm going to, what shall I wear? I was thinking I would wear my green dress that I had worn before to um, the gala. And then I thought, you know, I've got a lot of party dresses that I never wear. And I was coming home from the gym and they were playing Lady in Red. And I thought, you know, I have a red dress. Maybe I'll wear a red dress. So I went upstairs and got the red dress. And I did not realize that it had two little spots on it. One, two on the one side. Which it would have been, I was facing it, so it would have really been on the other side if it was on me. And so I decided I better wash this dress and see if those two spots can come out. So I put a little soap on it and scrubbed the spots. And I put it in the wash with all of my shirts that I have red. I have a lot of red, red tops. So all my red clothes are washed again. And so I can start all over again with the short or long sleeve, depending on the weather. And the dress turned out really good. It's nice and clean. So I'm debating, will I wear the red dress? It's got short sleeves and I'm afraid I'm going to be cold. That's the only reason that I would probably stay away from it. But I could always bring, I have a, a really nice, um, it's a silky shawl. I could bring that with me. And if I get cold, when you put that on you, it it does warm you and so I think I will use my black purse with my red dress and I will be wearing black shoes with my red dress and I'll bring my um, it's a it's a black shawl I think it's black but it's got something on the ends I don't remember it's been so many years since I've used it I don't even remember 
but I will wear that. And if I'm chilly, I will have something to put on. If I'm not chilly, then I'll be just great. And I'm going to be the lady in red. And Jim, I think, will wear a red tie just to match me. He does that. I have a feeling he will choose the red tie instead. So he'll wear his dark suit with his white shirt and a red tie to match me. And so I, I guess you'll get a video today. I won't be missing. And um, Farmer G, he um, made the comment that even with the power outage, I didn't miss. Well, the way I got that one out is I had to make it really, really short because Jim got me a hot spot on his phone. And because our house sits on, I don't know what it sits on, but it sucks the power out of everything. So cell phones don't work. A lot of times people will come here and if they have a cell phone, their cell phone won't even ring and then they'll leave and they'll have a lot of messages that somebody had left. There's something in our ground, I don't know where. We have to go way at the edge of the property to get away from it. And if um, you do use a cell phone here, sometimes it will take your, your cell to Canada and use those towers because they're closer than the one that's probably for us here to not make it a long distance. And so then they're, they're using up all their data because now it's gone to Canada. But that's uh, the way the cell phones are. So I don't know where I was going with all that. But anyways, I'm going to say goodbye. Oh, I know. It was the hot spot. I, I remembered. Whoa, I remembered. Okay. Well... That's it for today. I didn't drink any of my coffee. I do have it. It's getting, I'm holding it and it's it's still warm, but I'll have to probably warm it up a little more. And I hope you all have a great evening and I will be talking to you again tomorrow. So I'll see you. Bye.